Carlos Dominguez appeared in court for his arraignment this morning. It was a very short hearing. In fact, it only lasted five minutes. He pleaded not guilty to all of the charges, including the enhancements, and the prosecution has made clear they will not be seeking the death penalty. And here is a look at Dominguez this morning. Your Honor, I acknowledge receipt of the information, wait for the reading and advise on the rights. Uh, enter not guilty pleas to all counts and denials to all enhancements. He waived his right to a speedy trial, and you can see him in a striped jumpsuit. By law, the trial usually has to take place within 60 days of the arraignment. The former UC Davis college student is accused of stabbing and killing two men and the attempted murder of a woman last spring. Prosecutors say these were premeditated crimes. The stabbing spree created a lot of fear in the city of Davis as police searched for the killer for days, which investigators say they later determined was Dominguez. The public defender has argued that the former UC Davis college student was dealing with issues from schizophrenia. Dominguez is not eligible for bail. He is expected back here in court on June 18th, and that's when the lawyers and the judge will come up with an actual trial date. In Woodland, Leticia Ordaz, KCL Rate 3 News. Court observers say Dominguez is almost non-recognizable from his arrest. He now has a short haircut. He's more clean shaven, has a much healthier appearance, they say, after getting treatment at a state hospital.